Today I have got a book for you about Easter and Spot is here to join us and to listen and let's see what happens. It is Easter and Spot and his friend Helen want to go looking for Easter eggs. They have both got a little basket. Helen has got a pink basket, Spot has got a little yellow basket and Spot's mum says, the Easter Bunny has hidden some Easter eggs for you. And Spot says, come on Helen, let's go and find them. So they both go out into the garden. And in the garden, Spot says, hmm, how many Easter eggs has the Easter Bunny hidden? And behind the bush, there is oh, the Easter Bunny. And the Easter Bunny says, I have hidden six Easter eggs. And Spot and Helen run off and they start looking. And while they are looking, the Easter Bunny is hiding behind the fence and he is watching. And Helen is looking in the flowers. And Spot is looking under a pot. And has he found the first Easter egg? Yes! One Easter egg for Spot. And will they find more Easter eggs? Let's have a look. Yes! Helen has also found an Easter egg in the flowers. And look at that. The Easter Bunny is also there watching from behind the tree. And Spot... Spot has climbed up onto the red bench so he can look up in the tree. And are there more Easter eggs here? Let's have a look. <gasps> yes, there is an Easter egg in the bird's nest. So now Spot has already got two Easter eggs. Hmm, let's see. Who is going to find the next Easter egg? Hmm, is there an Easter egg here? No, they are counting their Easter eggs. Let's see. One, two, three Easter eggs. Are there any more Easter eggs? Let's look behind the blue door. Huh, it's the Easter Bunny. And he says, yes, there are three more Easter eggs. Hmm. So where are the other three Easter eggs? Let's go and see. Oh, Helen is looking behind the big yellow sack and the Easter Bunny is watching from in the blue hut. And what is behind the sack? Says Spot. There is another Easter egg. May I have it? Asks Helen. And of course, Helen can have it. So now they both have got two Easter eggs. And then they go into the house because maybe there are more Easter eggs in the house. And the Easter Bunny is watching from outside. And Spot says, hmm, maybe there is an Easter egg under the yellow stairs. Let's see. Oh, what is that? There is a mouse and the mouse says, Sorry, I only have cheese here. Hmm, no Easter eggs. So they have to keep looking. And where do they go next? Oh, they go to the living room. And look at that. The Easter Bunny has also come into the house to watch. And Spot has climbed up. And what does he see behind the cushion? Is there an Easter egg? Oh, oh no! It is the cat. And the cat says, meow, go away. Hmm, so still no Easter egg. Where can they be? So. They keep on looking and 
Uh oh, Spot has climbed up onto the table and Helen says, Spot, get off the table. And what can Spot see on the table? Is there going to be an Easter egg behind the fruit? Hmm. Yes, here's one and it's lying right next to an apple and the other apple is being eaten by the Easter Bunny. Hmm. So, now there still must be an egg somewhere. But where is the last Easter egg? <gasps> where can it be? Helen climbs into the big chest to look. And Spot says, maybe the last Easter egg is in here. And he opens the door of the big brown clock and oh, yes there's the Easter Bunny and he gives Spot the last Easter egg and Spot is really happy and he says yay I found the last Easter egg and then Spot and Helen go into the kitchen where Spot's mum is waiting and she says did you find all the Easter eggs, Spot? And Spot says, yes, and we have saved one Easter egg for you. Happy Easter. And that's the end. So I hope you enjoyed the story and I wish you all a happy Easter. Bye bye.